everyone, it's me Katty. Welcome to my channel Simply Stitch 888 and today I'm going to show you how to make this simple bag. This is one of the projects that I made. Um, it's my own creation, um, my own pattern and also I presented this in one of my Fresh Up The Hook video in the past couple of weeks. Um, one of my subscribers is um, asking to do a tutorial for this bag and she wanted to make her own too. So I'm going to share with you this um, bag that I made. It's pretty simple. Um, before we go to the tutorial, I'm going to explain to you how I did this first. Um, first, I uh, started at the bottom. I chained in uh, the single foundation uh, chain here 45 single foundation and also um, I made single crochet all the way around until I get this um, this length uh, this shape at the bottom and then I started to double crochet in here um, the reason why is to get this shape of this bag is that on the middle part I did a decreasing here. I decreased in on this part and then I double crochet in again each stitch here and then single crochet here. So in this um in the base of this bag I pretty much um used one um one skein of this yarn and this yarn that I use here uh before I forgot to tell you um I use filament nylon um, but you can also try the worsted weight yarn, so I think it's also good to use for this bag. Um, okay, so I'm going to continue the explanation here, and I also uh, single crochet in here. Um, and then, uh, I've I really, really not counted much here, I just uh, um, measure it where I would put my two handles you know so all I did is just I put the marker on how um, the, the size of these handle that I'm gonna make and um, this is like 10 rounds of single crochet back and forth all the way up and then I did the foundation chain again here single uh, single crochet foundation chain and then I chain in single crochet all the way back and forth like that to attach it together so that's how I made this handle and then I do it again on the other side uh, both each side for the handles so that's how I made that and also this pocket um, this is about let's just measure this uh, bag first the bag is about approximately 17 inches if you measure it, it that's the size of this bag and these two pockets here I just um, made a rectangular uh, shape uh, it, I think it's about 9 inches or 8 yeah so let's measure it's about 9 inches so I just made a rectangular shape for this uh, double crochet you know I just um, chain in first single crochet and then I just um, I just measured it until I have the length of 9 inches and then I made a double crochet in back and forth until I have this um, width and also the length so and then I attach it uh, as a whip stitch I just whip stitch in here to to make that two pockets on the side so that's pretty much it it's just easy uh, all I just did here is single uh, single crochet foundation chain and also um, double crochet and whip stitch here that's it that's the only um, stitch that I use here and also for the uh, linings the linings the, the way that I did the lining is I have this uh, cloth and then you have to fold it together and then what I did is I measure it on the outside until on this I mean under here and then I sew it into the sewing machine 
and then on this part on the top part I just fold it in like about half an inch and then sew it again sew it there and then we're gonna put it inside of it to make your linings it depends on you what kind of linings you want to put I didn't I haven't sewn in the lining first because I wanted to show you how I uh, do the lining and also um, you are going to uh, stitch in here if you don't have a sewing machine you can just um, stitch it uh, whip stitch in this uh, in this um, part not on the top part it has to be in this part so that's it so I hope you like it and and let's start the tutorial thanks hi everyone it's me Kathy Simply Stitch 888 and I'm going to show you what are the, um, the things that we needed for the bag making the bag um, actually this is a brand Need Needlo brand it's a filament nylon uh, each cane has a hundred eighty five yards to apply and um, this is good for making a bag so if you can find this kind of um, yarn in your craft store that would be great but also you can also try to use a um, worsted weight yarn so that's it but you have to have like two contrasting color for um, the handles and for the um, pocket and also you will need two different um, hook you need uh, size H hook and also I hook this one is for the base for the bag for the body and also this one is for the handles and also you need scissor and tapestry needle so let's get started okay so we're now going to start with the base of this bag we're going to do a 45 single crochet foundation chain here I'm going to show you how to make it First, you're going to do a slip knot. I hope you can see the um, yarn that I'm using. Okay, slip knot, and then let's put this aside. Okay, um, you're going to do chain uh, chain two first. Okay, and um, you can see there is a two loops there you're going to put your hook on that two loops on the first chain and then you're going to yarn over and then you just want to pull it through to that two loops you have two loops on top of your um, on your hook and then yarn over pull it through one loop first so you still have two and then yarn over again pull it through that two loops Okay, so that's your first uh, single foundation, single crochet foundation chain. Okay, next you're going to put your hook on the two loops again. There is two loops there, you can see it. And then you're going to yarn over and then pull it through. You have two loops on your hook. Yarn over and then pull through one loop. You have still two loops on your hook and then pull uh, yarn over and then pull it through two loops that's your second um, single foundation chain and then you're just going to put again to that two loops there yarn over pull through have two loops yarn over pull through one yarn over pull through two so that's how you made your um, single foundation chain okay you're going to look again for that two loops on that side I'm going to put your you can see that there's a two loops on that side okay yarn over pull through that loop you had two two loops on your hook yarn over pull one one loop 
yarn over, pull through two loops. Okay, so you you can just count in here, one, two, three, four. So you already have four. So you're gonna do forty-five of this, okay? Because this is the uh, the very first bottom part. This is the base of this bag that we're making, okay? So we, let's do it again. I'm going to put our hook on that middle. There is two loops on this side. You can see. Yarn over. Pull through that loops. Yarn over to one. Yarn over two. Okay. You're gonna see again there. You can just look at on the side. There's two loops there. Pull it through. One and two. Okay. Again. Pull it through. One, two. Put it again there. One, two. Okay. So just do that until you get forty five, and then I'll I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back here now with my uh, 45 single crochet foundation chain and after that you're going to chain one and then turn your work like that and then on the first chain you're going to um, two single crochet one and then two. Okay, next after that we're going to single crochet in all the way to the end of this row. Just gonna single crochet in all the way to the, to the end and I'll meet you there. 